Hello everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door, and we're back once again. It's my second episode of me finally being back to YouTube, man. Are you happy, Sponsor Hudson? Are you happy in me that I finally came back? I mean, you haven't been commenting at all lately, and you didn't even ask why I was gone, so I'm a little bit upset. I'm a little hurt, to be honest, man. Me and Sponsor Hudson, we had this relationship when he watches my videos, and he says shit, and I say shit back to him for like for like a whole year now, and he just suddenly stopped. I'm hurt. I'm honestly hurt, man. I don't know. Stop being fake hurt and actually play video games. Alright, so, Mr. Russian Penguin Detective guy wanted to talk to me about something, but I don't remember where anything is. Um, I don't know where his room is. Room 5 is mine, right? And room 4 is something. Or the other, I don't know. Hello, weird toad girl who's kind of cute, but not really because you're a toad. I, I refuse to like toads. I refuse to be sexually attracted to a toad. I refuse. Not happening. Is this room? Ah, it's this room. I remember he's the first guy I saw. Alright. Hello. What do you want to talk about? I, I was pretty sure you are going to be murdered when I walked in this room, but you're still alive, which is unfortunate. <laughs> I've been waiting. I was rather impressed with your work on this last case, I must admit. Alright. Rather impressed. I mean, I did all the work and just sat around falsely accusing people, so I'm better than a detective than you. Now that I do not think the one you apprehend is a sticky, yummy, not chondrit. But yeah, how is he going to blow up the train if he's so fat, man? He had to move around put bombs all over the train. I don't even know why I'm thinking they're going to blow up the train. They never said they're going to blow up the train. I'm just putting this, these, these words, this idea in my head, and it's not even the idea that's happening. I do this is the lack of incriminating clues in this room. Alright, maybe he ate the clues. How about that? It's hiding in his stomach. Like a real, like a mafia member, man. In any case, I must say, I believe you have certain knack for detective work. Better than knack than the actual goddamn detective, that's for sure. So just decide then. I will take you on. You can't just decide that for me. I have rights. I'm a human being. I should take you on as my new assistant. No. You can't just decide that. Three eight. My name is Pink Pink uh, Pennington. I am a detective from Poshley Heights. Where are you now? Why are you on a train then? I am known in some circles as the Penguin with the improbably large brain. And I am known as the Human with the improbably. Big, giant, gamer brain. That's what I'm known for. Okay, can you say you're known as that? No, I'm known even, I have a bigger title than you, man. I have a bigger brain than you. You small brain. Me, 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 me. What the hell am I saying? Me, big brain, gamer brain. I, my mind just went to a giant loop. I don't even know what happened. I'm sure you ever heard of me. So as I will say on the subject. As for your name. Wait, I demand you do not tell me. Wait, why? What? I shall deduce your identity. Alright, I wanna have- oh my god, if you call me- if they, if they shoehorn in a Gonzalez joke here, I'm gonna be pissed! That mustache. That nose. Oh, oh, oh. All too easy. Um, what? You so obviously the famed Luigi, are you not? Well, that's the first. That's the first time someone's confused Mario for Luigi. It's usually the other way around or someone confuses Luigi for Mario. Well, that's a first. Uh, I guess I'm happy for Luigi, I guess. What? God, you know, Mario, just let just let your brother have his moment. You never defend your brother when they when people mistakenly mistake him for you, but you you care so much that people think you're Luigi, man. You think that little of your brother that you only want to be thought of as Luigi? God, Mario's just a terrible brother. Hate him. No need to introduce yourself. I know all about the famous Luigi. Well, if I want to be known as anyone, Luigi's fine, I guess. That's the, that's the one time I, I'm okay with being named wrong. All right. About this threat, I've managed to clear the tent to yummify the train. Yep, yummify the train. It's gonna turn it into. Gonna... When he means yummify, does it mean like turn it into food? Is it gonna be the fat shy guy? That's my first. That's my first thought. A sticky, tasty explosion. Oh, don't, 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 don't let me visualize that. The family bubbums. They are definitely suspect. Why? Because they're rich. I agree. Rich people are the root of all evil. Capitalism. God damn it. Now, Luigi, we will deduce this case to rudimentary facts and deduce the truth. Let's do this, man. Use our big gamer brains. I mean, I'm the only one in this room with a big gamer brain. Sorry, Mr. Assface, you were born like a week ago. Your, your gamer brain's not developed enough yet. Sorry, didn't mean to insult you. Uh, wait, ah, fuck, I've been forgetting. It's been so long I forgot I can do this shit. 
Umbella, tell me about this ass clown. That's Pinkerton, a train passenger. He says Detective I don't know. Yeah, I don't know either, man. But why do detective types always show up when something goes wrong, huh? Yeah, it's suspicious, man. Makes me think it actually is him. He's one behind it. Let's go tattle everyone else then. Whoa, what's... What the hell is happening? Uh, oh, it's probably nighttime. The sun's probably going down because time is passing, maybe. Jesus, I don't know what the hell that was. Like some Twilight Zone shit or something, man. I was getting so confused. What's going on here? Well, it's so, it's so weird. Alright, talk, talk, tell, I can't speak. Tell me about this guy. I need to slow down so I can actually say words. This is Sumi, the cook aboard the Excess Express. He cooks for everyone. I can't figure this guy out. I have no idea if he's joking most of the time. What do you mean? I don't know what you're talking about. Or about the cute little toad girl. Hello. That's the waitress the Excess Express, kind of spacey. Think she's an okay waitress? Probably not, but always. <laughs> but guys always go for the girls like this, don't they? Why is that, Mario? I don't know, man, cause they're cute, I guess. Look at her, she got a heart on her head. Don't tell me that's not fucking cute. Don't tell me if you if you were gay, you wouldn't go for that. I mean, I wouldn't. Wait, what? Well, actually, that makes sense. If I was gay, I, I definitely wouldn't go for that because, well, I, I'm a man. If, if I was gay, I, 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 I would like men. So yeah, I definitely would not go for that if I was gay. Big brain. What the hell am I doing again? Oh, yeah, I'm, trying to, I'm trying to find the rich bomb people and convict them of a the crime because all capitalist scum must die. You must stand up for, for for communism. Equality for all. Yes, and I will reign on top and take all the money for myself and still claim that, that it's, it's equality for everyone because communism. That's how communism works, huh? Alright, hello, capitalist scum. Are they arguing right now? I don't want to hear rich people argue about fucking rich people shit, man. He needs something. Spencer Gotti. No, you just don't use toy. What are you guys yelling about? What are they yelling about? You don't, you, you don't want to be here listening to this kid. Go fuck it outside play some fucking b-ball or something. You don't want to listen to your fucking your old people yell. Mommy, they're fighting about what to give me for my birthday. They wouldn't be fighting about this if you weren't such a spoiled brat, you know. I'm so bored. I wish I brought my Game Boy Advance. Man, can you stop advertising Game Boys, Nintendo? Jeez, man. Nice job dating the game, Nintendo. Alright, so just wait, you guys are busy. What? I can't I can't like, go through your drawers? Why not, man? What do you even have in there? You don't wear clothes besides shoes. You got like a bunch of shoes in here or something? Alright, what are you guys what are you guys doing? I wish you could fill Bob the Advance Learners classic series of Bobomery. What the hell is that? Is that a book? Two words. Cheap and boring. Think about the jurious, dear. Perhaps a car. How? You're gonna buy your kid a house? Spoiled brat. You kidding me? Papa too too small for such what? Papa's too small for just yeah. He's he's too small. Yeah. Gold Bob, stop thinking of your own social status. He needs something that will further his education. Not spoil him, honestly. Oh, well at least the uh, the wife has the right idea, man. Don't spoil your damn kid. <laughs> that stuff you're talking about then what the hell do you want just tell them god hey mister are you technically now that you quit being a champion yep i got many professions man i'm a I'm, I'm princess saver a dragon turtle slayer a plumber a fucking champion of a fighting pit champion of a fight club now i'm a detective man mario is a man with many jobs hey mister now you're a detective oh, i already read this well, so, do you get to take what I really want for my birthday? Uh, I'd rather not, but let's just give it a try, I guess. I got nothing better to do. Really cool. If you bring me what I really want, I'll give you something in return. What, you want me to figure this out? What the hell would a fucking rich, spoiled little brat want, huh? Oh my god, whatever. I don't know. What do you want? What does he want? He wants something, but he wants me to bring it to him, man. Why does he assume that what he wants is on this train? Actually, wait. Maybe he wants a mystery. I mean, it is a gift, right? It's gift wrapped, so maybe it's the mystery thing I bought. Maybe. The only place you can get stuff from the train is here, at the item shop. This is the only place where items are available. Alright, what? He, he, I don't think I don't think he went on a thunder rage. I'll probably light him on fire and he'll explode, so... 
mystery, I don't know. A boo sheet? Maybe the kid wants to turn invisible like Harry Potter, man. You know, you kids like Harry Potter, right? They like being invisible, pranking people. Um, uh, medicine. I don't think kids want medicine, no. Um, syrup. You know, syrup's good, right? A mushroom. I don't even know how you eat this since bombs don't have mouths. How do, how do they even talk? I was not think about that. I'm tired of thinking about fucking, fucking the biology of, of all these crazy paper bomb, th these weird people. How they do things that makes no sense to me. I don't know, man. Anyway, let's, let's go give the guy the mystery present, I guess. That's the only thing I can think of to give to him. It's not, ooh, the screen shakes a little bit. Nice. And we're moving on a train. I didn't even notice that because I don't pay attention to small details like this. What is this room, right? 007. Hmm. It was not this room. This is his fucking nerd mouse room. I don't, I don't want to fucking hang out with nerd mouse. God, what a nerd. I don't know, man. Hello, I brought you. I brought you a good gift. It's so good, even I don't know what it is. Look, here's a hit. It starts with an A. Got it? It starts with an A. Well, that could be a lot of things. It could be an apple. It could be an uh, albino spider, an albino rhino, an albino Yoshi, an albino Italian man. I don't know why albinos become the joke I'm just gonna do right now. An albino boo. I don't know how a, a ghost could be albino. They're already pretty white. Or right, so an A. Anything in here starts with A. Maple, super shroom, tasty, bullshit, mystery. Thunder Age. None of these start with A. Uh, oh, I know what you want. Just kid. I'm, I'm not gonna make that joke, man. I was about to say, like, fucking... You know what I was gonna say, man. You know what I was gonna say with my sixth grade level humor, man. Just, just think of a curse word. Think of a curse word that starts with A, man. You know what I was gonna say. I'm not gonna say that, man. That's, that's the second time this session I've already al almost made an appropriate joke with children. I am f a fucking idiot. Alright, what does this damn kid want? Huh? What does this damn spoiled little brat want? Why can't you just tell me? Stop being damn mysterious and shit. Alright, what does he want? Maybe he wants something from the engine room, man. Maybe he wants... Maybe I'd like to take something off this. Hello, anything? You have any? I'm gonna talk to you again, man. I don't want to talk to you more than I have to. I can't think. A. A, girl? I don't know. Uh, what about this? Hello? What do you have in here? I'm just, I'm just gonna go through your drawer see if you have anything. Is there postcards or glossaries featuring zip toe inside? This guy's what? Are you kidding me? This guy's has postcards of himself? Look at egotistical maniac. God, so full of himself. You're a goddamn toad. You don't have any right to be full of yourself. This must be like the upper class area because there's a bunch of rich, posh people here. Or maybe, maybe, you know, maybe the kid wants makeup. Maybe, maybe, you know, he swings that way. You want, you know, f try some makeup. Uh, John Dan? Nope. Guess the kid doesn't want to be gay. Oh, well. <laughs> Guess the kid doesn't want to be gay. Oh, well. Uh, I said that way too disappointingly, man. Alright, fat ass, got anything for me? Spoon, fork, lantern, plant, chair. None of these start with A. Magazine. Literally nothing here starts with an A. Are you kidding me? Nothing. I can't think of anything on this goddamn train that starts with an A. Wallpaper. Lamp. Door. Fucking floor. Walls. Mario. Hats. Shoes. Overalls. Oh my god, nothing starts with A. Uh, plate. Uh, cup. Nothing. Are you kidding me? Uh, wine. Beer bottle. Pot. Hat, fish, toad, a uh, mushroom, a uh, flower, nothing. What am I looking for? Nothing here. Literally nothing here starts with A. What about you, Mr. Detective Dickface? You know anything? You know what I'm looking for? The thing that the uh, master want, Bub wants most? Well, let's see. Let's do, shall we? Well, that's rudimentary. He wants a Game Boy Advance. What? It starts with an A. It, it, the Game Boy does not start with an A. The Advance comes with the last part. No, you're dumb. Oh, my friend. It's but a young child. They crave above all else. Alright, but it, it doesn't start with A. It doesn't. There's several detective novels here. Ha, this guy's a wannabe. He's not even a real detective, man. He just reads detective novels to pretend he's a detective, man. Loser. 
I'm so mean this session, man. I don't know what's wrong with me. I'm such an asshole, as I usually am. What about here? What about you, Mr. Nerd Mouse? You got any bright ideas? You look smart and stuff, right? Any ideas? You got a tie, a tail. Nothing here starts with A. I'm really looking forward to plopping that stew in my expenses account. Oh, well, it's all the most next expensive thing on the dinner menu. All right, fine. You do that. I don't care about your life. Nothing in here. You are such a goddamn nerd. You got nothing in your drawers, man. Why are you carrying on this shit in like your little fucking mouse pockets? You don't even have pockets. You don't even wear pants. You're, you're like holding your, all your shit in your tie pocket? What the hell? Or what am I looking for? 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 I'm gonna jump off the goddamn window. What am I looking for? Tell me. Second hint. The certain person's auto. Oh my. You can't. <laughs> How was I supposed to figure that out? You want an autograph? But there are always a cute to build dreams of being a train engineer someday. Oh, that's cute. Why don't you build a train for a rich kid like that? <laughs> yeah, I guess, man. You probably ride trains a lot, so you probably like them because you fucking parents want to go buy expensive gifts, gifts all the time. So yeah, he probably likes trains. All right, so he wants an autograph from the rich toad guy, probably, right? Maybe. But how do I do that? I don't have paper. So, how, how do I do that? And how was I supposed to figure that out in the first place, to be honest? So I gotta run all the way back down this side of the train. At least I'm getting good cardio. I'm not gonna get fat like that fucking toad ale to stew. Alright, here. First class, 001. Right, can you give me your autograph, please? Was that little bub kid wants a present? Uh... I'm sure. It, wait, this is not your voice. Well, I'm sure we still have an autograph from mine, right, guy? Oh, my don't think all. Oh, I can't do it, unfortunately. I'm sorry for chicks. You kidding me? Hey, Gonzalez. Wait, that's not your voice. Hey, Gonzalez. That's not your voice. Uh, 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 do his voice right. You think that kid might want something from a guy he might have made, maybe? What he wants, we gotta give it. See what else? Boom. Yummy and sticky. Um, how? What? How does that even correlate? All right. All right, so you only give it to a girl. Well, I got several girls here. Actually, apparently, I got spoiled on Twitter. And apparently, Vivian is not a girl. Apparently, you see it. I mean, she is. I, I, I'm getting confused. I, I need to say this carefully. She's trans. So she is a girl. I almost fucked it up. I almost got canceled. That would have been the end of my career. Over! Disclaimer! No! She girl! She trans! Yes! Oh! That, that, that was way too close. Alright, uh... What, what do you think he likes? Think he, you think he like a girl? You think he like this type of girl? Thick girl? Or, you know, small and cute? I don't know, man. I, I think he like his women, his women thick. How about that? What's up? You like your women thick, boy? What's it, the bub kid wants a prince? The bub I oh, mean, to the uh, only side for chicks. Mario, darling! Don't you think perhaps the young child wants to think with something he admires? What does he crazy and find before the train goes yummy and sticky? Alright, fine. Doesn't like his women big. You know, you can just show him his masterful blowing skills and maybe he'll change his mind. You know what I mean? <laughs> Sex jokes are funny. I don't know, maybe, you know, he, maybe he likes, you know, the trans girls. Nothing wrong with like a trans girl, right? Huh? Alright, Mario! Is there any chance Bubba wants something from Percy Ma- We- Why are people saying the same thing? Flirt with this guy so I can get the autograph, alright? He wants to give it to chicks. And why is this guy such an asshole? You won't give an autograph to a kid just because he's not a chick? The fuck is wrong with you? Fucking crushing a kid's dreams like this. What the hell is your problem? And why don't you like her because she's not a quote-unquote real girl? Transphobic! I don't know, man. I'm being stupid. Alright, fine. You like a girl? You like your girls with no arms, huh? You like your? I don't even know what that's called. Lymphetic? I don't know what that's called, man. I, I had a good joke, but I don't know words, so my joke failed. Great. Are you, you like Goomba girls, man? Come on, you're both mushrooms. Hey, you like both? Mm. You know what? Fine. I'm just gonna steal it. Are you? <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm 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 pissed. What am I supposed to do? I'm just running back and forth. Do I have to go talk to Mr. Dickhead Penguin Detective again? And then he'll give me another one of his brilliant ideas? And then everything will be good. 
Or do I have to go all the way back to the kid and talk to him to a third time? Or am I gonna have to dress up as a girl just to get him to give me an autograph? That'd be great. That'd be amazing. That'd be my favorite thing to do. Hello, can you please give me an idea, Mr. Detective Russian Penguin? The thing, you already know, you already told me that it's not that. You are small brain. You are the smallest brain ever. My brain is so big that I can recognize people who have small brains. And your brain is one of the smallest of them all. God damn it. We're wasting so much time with this shit. Or can you stop being facetious? Just tell me what I need to know. Yeah, my gosh. Certain person's autograph. Yes, I know that. Jeez, just let me do what I want to do. I already said that. You know, wait, what? Wait, it's different. You don't think Bob might say something? Wait, what? You're saying the same thing when I'm talking to the guy, man. What? What's happening? I don't know, man. I have no idea. I hate wasting time. This always happens. We get stuck on something stupid. Then we run around for an entire episode getting nothing done. And then I have to sit here saying dumb shit in hopes of entertaining you people so you don't lose interest and click away from the video. So, please stay here. Don't click away. Don't worry. I'll, I'll promise we'll, we'll accomplish this as soon as possible. God, I'm getting such a workout as running back and forth from each end of the train, man. It's good cardio. Fucking nice! Or maybe I should tattle you. Maybe that will do something. I knew I knew him! That's Zip Toe, the movie star! Let me go nuts for him! You know, he's not hot and all, but he's pretty stuck up about being famous. That's all celebrities are kind of like that. It's too bad, I kind of like him. Don't know, Goombella, don't like him. I, I thought I thought I knew you better. Goombella, I, I, I thought I thought you you someone I could like, but you like someone like that. No. Why, Goombella? Why? You betrayed me like that. Or what should I do? He's being a dick face and he won't give me when I want. I used an asshole. Well, I'm sure you don't know, right? Oh man, wait, I have an idea. Ah, I have an idea. I have an idea. You know, the girl... I mean, I don't know why I have to do it like this, but I'm assuming we have to talk to the cute toad girl. And get her to talk to him, get his autograph, and then steal it from her or something crazy like that. Because why the hell not? Yeah, why the hell not? Alright, let's do it, man. I mean, yeah, he probably likes only his own kind, because he's racist or something, right, man? Doesn't even look like Gumbella. Doesn't even look like fucking... I forgot half these people's names. Who the hell are you again? Flurry. Vivian. Because he's goddamn racist, man. The only fuck, he don't, he don't want to split blood, because he's fucking... White Toad with white privilege. I don't even know what I'm saying now. I'm ranting. They told you back that Chubby got in record time. I was way impressed. How impressed were you, girl? I'm thinking... I guess you use your skills. Oh. Could you help me? Boy! We get late tonight! <laughs> no. Alright, what do you want help with? Really? Well, okay, so I lost these shell earrings that my ex-boyfriend gave me. Oh, ex-boyfriend, you say? They're like all full of memories and stuff. I really need them back. Could you maybe look for them or something? Alright, I'll do that. Please? Alright, fine. Boy! If we do this, we're getting late tonight. But I told girl, I don't know. I don't know why I'm so excited about this. I'm not, but I'm I'm unironically excited about. It. I mean, ironically excited about. It. That's what I meant. Yep, yeah, totally, totally not unironically excited about that at all. Great. So we got searched for another thing at another place for at another time. Amazing. Great. I love. Or can you tell me where it might be? Welcome to the dining car! You're just a great extra much for agreeing to find my shell earrings. Alright, so the shell earrings, it means there are likely shells. Maybe this guy just knows something about, so he's the fish guy, right? He gets around the ocean, knows things about shelves. Yes, about this thief. I'm actually pleased he craved my stew enough to steal the entire pot. My heart is filled with anger, but rather the war of a broth and satisfaction. Alright, cool. Don't care. Cool story, bro. Alright, so... We're looking for a second thing out of all the damn things we need to find. Can someone just get murdered already so we can get to the actual interesting stuff, please? Or maybe these guys know stuff about shell earrings. It's, I don't know, they're rich people. Maybe they stole it because they're rich. Uh, can I search through your drawers? Please, let me search through your drawers. 
I want to search through your jars, but you won't let me search through your jars. Cause you rich people, dick face. Or about you. Let's talk to people again. Yup. Great. Great. You know what? There's one person we gotta spoke to. The guy at the front of the train. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Oh my god, can you shut up? I don't care. I know. I know. Stop repeat stuff. Do not repeat stuff, please. We should probably start, you know, using our Yoshi slave, Mr. Assface, to get around. No, not big booby cloudy lady. As much as good as her, you know, master for blowing skills are, we kind of don't need them right now, at this very moment. Alright, we should probably be using this to go faster. I literally learned that last episode. That, you know, it's much better and more efficient to use this. It is walking normally, so we should probably, you know, start using this. You know, accelerate the pace, we, you know, get stuff done and all that. Anyway, now what? Who would have shell earrings? Maybe she dropped them in the machinery in the front of the train. I don't know why she would have been up there. Actually, that might be suspicious. If her earrings are up there, how do they get there? Maybe that's the mystery. If they're up here, she's doing something in the train up here, man. It was her the entire time. What was this? Nothing. We're probably gonna have to do something here at one point, right? There's a whole lot of twist stuff, there's a panel and all this shit. What? No, I don't want your auto, right? Oh. Mmm. How does this not click in my head? Huh? I'm sorry. My brain is just so dumb. Why did I automatically assume it was the fucking lame toad loser? Oh my god, he literally talked about how he wanted to be a train conductor. Mm, I'm so angry my eyes are going cross-eyed. Mm, my brain is sometimes not very big. You are my autograph, sir? That's your little pup! Well, yes, of course! Here you are, sir! Oh my god, well, there we go. Autograph, the autograph of the excess express engineer, we did it! Gosh, you never gave out an autograph before! That felt fantastic! Well, enjoy it while it lasts, man. It's probably the only autograph you're ever gonna fill out because you're a goddamn train conductor. Or right, stop being so salty and insulting that guy's, you know, fucking job profession, man. There's nothing wrong with being a, a train conductor, man. Nothing wrong with that, man. I don't know. I'm just angry because I wasted so much time running around when the solution was so simple. Sometimes my big brain is so big that I'm overthinking things and overcomplicating things to giant proportions that don't even make sense. Cause that's just how big brain my- my big- my, that, I can't speak- how big my brain is. It gets so big that it wraps right around to being stupid again. That's, that's just how big, brain, my, big my brain is. I cannot speak at all today. I need to learn to slow my roll and stop speaking so fast or in here. All right, I got your autograph from Mr. Train Man. So did you bring me the thing I want most? Of course I did, dude. Here you go. An autograph from a train guy, because that's normal, I guess. I don't know, man. Kids have their own interests. Can't judge. Here you go, man. Yeah, bingo, mister. That's what I wanted. You're a good detective. Yeah, I guess. I mean, not. yeah, I, I'm not going to lie. It took me way more time than I wanted to make to figure that out. Here's something really just like said. A shine sprite. It was a waste of time. Thanks for the autograph. I'll take good care of it. I promise. I mean, cool a shine sprite, but still, I kind of don't expect you like to have the shell earrings for some reason. Or can you stop like stop arguing now? He already has what he wants. We get him something that at the station of the family. Stop thinking of your goddamn self or thinking your own goddamn kid, man. Come on now. I have a reputation to think of, Sylvia. No one cares about your reputation. Oh my God, rich people, man. Using their sons as the extension of their own wealth. Ooh, time's passed again because we actually accomplished something. Every time we solve a mystery, it seems time passes. Oh, if that's how it works, it's going to take us like six more mysteries to get to the goddamn town. Damn it. Alright, now what? Should we just head back to our room and sleep? Maybe. Nothing else probably going to happen here today, right? I mean, we need our sleep, man. I can't, we can't just spend the entire day doing... Oh. What happened? Don't tell me the game crashed. Uh, annoyed point. Oh no, 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 annoyed pointer. Oh no, please. Yep. Well, 
it's stuck in an unknown pointer loop, which isn't good. So I'm going to have to fix that. I mean, probably as simple as changing what graphics setting I use, as I did last time, but... Ugh, this is dumb. Well, I guess I'm ending the episode here on this unknown pointer that you can't even see. For you, it just looks like the game crash, but trust me, it did. Look. Unknown pointer, unknown pointer, unknown pointer. Anyway... Hope you enjoyed this awful session of me finally coming back to Paper Mario, and honestly, I've enjoyed it a little bit. I still need to learn. That's one thing I, I need to learn, is to speak more clearly. Put some time into the shit I'm saying, like, like you know, between them, so I'm not just spathering a bunch of random bullshit everywhere. So, anyway, hope you enjoyed this episode of Paper Mario 1000 Door. The next one... Hopefully someone will get murdered and we'll actually get a good mystery and stuff like that. I don't know, man. And we hope you enjoy, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.